mentally strong, some financially strong, some social strong, we have escaped that. So they say now, but now look what he says in this fifth verse. And he shook off the beast into the fire and fell no more. I love that. I can have every time I get to preach this. And he, they was looking for him to flow. Wonder why is it that church folks, when they know you have gone through some storms, and, and then when the storm look like put you down, something else fastened on to you. And they say, well, now nah, this gonna take him out. He can't survive this. This gonna take him out. Uh, he, yeah, he going around talking about he's a child of God, but he, he escaped the storm, but not this minute. We know what this venom can do. This 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 gossip venom is too rough for him. It's too he can't escape this gossip venom. This gossip venom has brought a lot of great men down. Wow. Oh, I get happy when I get to preaching this, and I look at it from a spiritual point of view that they was looking for him to fall. Wow. Oh, isn't it funny how church folk can watch you, still are praying for you? They see whether we we know you're gonna fall now. We just gonna sit back and watch you. <laughs> oh, I'm going somewhere this morning. It, it, but, but instead of that, he shook it off. I, I thought about when the Lord was lying me to come back here. I thought about that song and that goat that that fell in the well, and the farmer said, "Well, I can't get him out. I'm just gonna show some dirty over." And, and, and the songwriter he tells a story about this goat and how this farmer decided to go bury him in a well and no more some dirt on him and he says that when the dirt falls on his back the goat shakes his own and traps his under his bed and, 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 and he kept throwing dirt in and the goat kept trapping it under him and, and then all of a sudden the goat came on out because he had threw enough dirt. Some folks are throwing dirt on you. Oh uh, yeah but you had to learn to shake it off. If you don't shake it off it'll get you down. Irregardless of what happened to you in life, one thing you need to make sure that you know who you are and whom. Yes, the barbarians, they was kind to the 276 passengers uh, that was on the ship. Uh, and uh, Paul was a man, uh, yes, who believed in the law. And uh, Paul had all early stated that I'm, I'm not beholden to no man. Well. Paul was not a major preacher. No, Paul went out.